offseason, we, we heard Coach talk about the process of snapping the football, coming off the ball, and making the plays that way. I'm just curious how Vito Vea kind of accelerates that challenge for you in that position. Yeah, I mean, uh, we've been uh, only able to go against our defense, and obviously we have a great defense. So being able to go against a new face and a, a good player like Vita that uh, plays different techniques and a little different game than ours, uh, it's good to see that. And it's uh, obviously good to be able to work on that just to perfect a craft at a new position. What do you think the offensive line did well as a unit today? Um, you know, I think we responded. We came into a, uh, a new area, and uh, I think we all kind of came together and responded well. Uh, throughout all the groups. What's uh, Peter Vail like to go against? Uh, you know, he's an Islander, so he's a big old hunker down man. He's down to, down to the earth, so you just got to get low on him and uh, get under his pads. But he's a he's a well-respected player, and he's a great player, and I uh, love being able to go against him just to be able to fine-tune yourself, you know? All right, what's the intensity? What's the difference in intensity when you can't practice as opposed to Uh, I mean, it's obviously pretty close. I mean, we're all super competitors. So just to be able to go against uh, somebody you don't know, and uh, there's always those nerves, and there's always that level of competition. And so, I mean, this is the highest level. So obviously, we're going to compete at the highest level. And so it was good work today. What's your, what's your level of confidence at center at this point? What have you been doing to work on this? I'd say I'm uh, fully confident. And uh, definitely, um, over the past work we've been able to do, I think uh, moving into the season, I'm fully confident as as I have been at any position prior to the season. What's the snapping situation? Obviously, they're not errant snaps, but they're not ideal snaps from a target standpoint. How do you get that corrected? That's kind of harsh. Um, <laughs> obviously, it's just perfecting your craft. You know, it's day in, day out, just trying to hit the batter box. And, uh, and you know, we get reps uh, whenever we can, uh, however we can. And so it's just being able to get it in the box every time. And so even when in those stressed out situations where, you know, you got to you got to move wide really quick right when the snap of the ball, being able to snap it and then get out and just uh, being able to perfect that. Connor, how has Frank Smith helped you, I, I guess, transition to center? I guess mm -hmm. Mike told us the other day that he was Roethlisberger center in college. Mm -hmm. So have you gotten the sense of that? Or have you? Felt that former center mentality. I mean, I mean, he's a, he's he's been a great uh, he's been a great resource. He's a great coach and definitely uh, knows the O line game very well. And so, I mean, uh, biggest thing he said to me was uh, like Avatar, like that connection to uh, to riding that horse. That's what me and two got to have. And so that's what we've been forming and uh, and feeling that. But he's a great coach, great resource. Uh, can go to him whatever you need, and he's there for you. Um, tremendously. I mean, just being able to know the guy you're playing with, and um, definitely when you're under center, you got to have that connection, so you so you know where to put lace and everything. And I think uh, we're getting that and growing that. Nice to have uh, Michael Peter back. And how did he look today? He looked good. Uh, I think he was really excited to be able to get back out on the field, and uh, we obviously missed him. He's a great. I mean, he's a he's a great person. He's a great contribution to the line, and I mean, we needed him out there, and so I think he did very well. Right, One more. We got two. Coach McDaniel mentioned before practice that the Bucks have a Bucks defensive front has a high penetration rate. Mm -hmm. um, what 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 did what did you notice coming into these uh, practices, and what did you notice today relative to um, how they try to attack and how the offensive line can counter that? I mean, obviously, every defense has their has their pros and cons and their focuses, and so they just have a they really focused on good get off and then being able to read. So with that, you just got to be able to get your first steps in the ground and uh, and work in unison, get the plays calls down, and be able to make take that initial surge and then be able to extend the play.